So I've been making a lot of videos about old classic devices and the Nokia Lumia 1020 is one of them. So back in 2013, Nokia released this Windows Phone Classic. The Lumia 1020, it was a device that was all about the cameras. So let's go back down to memory lane. What's up everybody, this is Eric the Tech Preacher. So I have the Lumia 1020, a very special device on the Windows ecosystem. And y'all guys know I've been pulling out some old devices, but this one right here is a classic. So let's talk about it. Sit back and relax and get your popcorn ready. Mm, mm, mm. And follow me on this journey. Let's go. What's up guys, this is Eric back with another video. Oh man, this is a classic. The Nokia Lumia 1020 was one of Windows Phone's best devices yet, right? When it comes down to the cameras, way back in 2013. So as we talk about the specs, let's reminisce on the design of this device. This phone is rocking a 4.5 inch, 768 by 1280 resolution. It got the Snapdragon uh, S4 Plus processor with two gigs of RAM, 32 gigs of internal storage, no SD card support. It got a headphone jack on here though. But all the magic happens on the rear, right? 41 megapixel camera on here, 2.2 aperture, 26 millimeter wide angle lens with autofocus and image stabilization for video. When we talk about video, this device can shoot 1080p up to 30 frames per second. And when we talk about the battery life on here, this phone is rocking a 2000 milliamp battery. And lastly, when this phone came out, it was running Windows 8. It got updated to Windows 8.1, but unfortunately the app stores don't work on this device. Uh, I have issues trying to update anything. Look, Windows Mobile is closed. So uh, me reviewing this device, it's all about the design and the build quality and stuff like that. As we talk about the design, man, I wish that we could have the same material that Nokia use on the devices. It's a clean, strong built device, uh, not a scratch on it, right? And you don't even need a case for these devices because it won't break. The display on here, it was really tough. Uh, the performance on here with the S4, a plus processor with two gigs of RAM. This phone ran like a champ. Uh, even today, uh, even though the app store don't work, but going through the OS, opening up some of the apps that do work, uh, this device flies through everything without a doubt. But this device was all about the cameras, right? I mean, look, the tile and the interface and everything, Windows Phone had a beautiful design. This was, oh my God, this was like, like no other. Now, when this phone came out back in 2013, people criticized of the huge Oreo back, but now in 2021, we start seeing the same type of designs that Nokia have done way back in 2013. So, I mean, this is one of the best, cleanest looking devices that I've ever had, right? <laughs> And I want y'all got to see some real life footage here of this device. Let me tell you something, back in 2013, this device was considered the best camera phone, period, when it comes down to still footage and photography, right? And video. Uh, I'm shooting this at 1080p, 30 frames per second. And look at the image quality coming out of this device. I'm still blown away to this day in 2021 on how good this camera phone is. Now, look, this phone got autofocus, Right? It has all kinds of unique features. This device has two camera apps on there and it works fantastic. So even in 2021, uh, this device is just blazing good. Now we know we're in 2021, we got better cameras, but man, if you go back down to 2013, this was the best camera phone out, kind of beating everything out there 
all the competition got beat by the, by the Lumia 1020. Uh, without a doubt, this device had two camera apps. It had the Lumia camera app, it had the regular camera app. If you want to get a lot of still footage and video footage, you had two choices when it comes down to cameras. When we talk about the build quality here, on the side here you have your volume rocker, you got your power button in, and all your Nokia devices always had a dedicated camera shutter. So when you press it, the camera open, and you got a lot of options uh, to shoot video and still footage with this device. Man, I love doing these throwback uh, Thursday videos, and the Nokia 1020 is one of my favorites. Look, I'm going to continue to do these type of videos. I think I, I really enjoy making these videos, you know, just kind of laid back, just shooting the video, having some fun, pulling out old classic devices and, and showing y'all guys that look, this, when we talk about going back down the memory lane, when you pull out a device that look like this, this is memory lane. Nokia Lumia 1020, one of the best Windows phones period when it comes down to photography and video back in 2013. This is Eric the Tech Preacher from Easy Computer Solutions. Leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about the Nokia Lumia 1020 in all its glory. See you guys on the next video. Peace.